Good morning, everyone. Another day, another beautiful day at the mm-hmm. Space at Port Jefferson and another edition and segment of Coffee Talk. My guest today is Bonnie Bittner. Uh, definitely an artist. Definitely Thank caught you. my eye. And I have to say, uh, this happens once in a while. You, you're scrolling through your Instagram and you're seeing a lot of baloney and then you're seeing beautiful work. And Bonnie, that's what caught my eye. Your, you. your attention to detail, your creativity in glass art. And... The story goes, I said, hey, would you be interested in doing a podcast? Because more people need to know about what you do. Why don't yes. you tell us what you do do? What is your passion? Uh, glass. Um, <laughs> I uh, took a class about 20 years ago and enjoyed it, but didn't really do anything with it. I made a few pieces for family members and gifts and everything. And my husband about four and a half years ago said, you need to get out in the world so people can find you and you can create for them. So we found a place in Port Jeff Station and I opened it up and it became my own version of Field of Dreams. Kind of, I just opened it up on a whim and it's been going great ever since. Let's just hold that piece up so people understand what what type of art we're talking about. I believe this is the piece that actually caught my eye. Yes. Um, This, uh, I describe it, you know, how long something like this takes to make I understand this is a customer's piece yes, this that's is, on order. Yep, this is heading to Japan. Um, this piece is made up of a, a variety of rectangles, squares, and um, kind of odd cut shapes. And just uh, what I do is I take a piece of glass and I mm-hmm. cut it down to size. I grind it, wrap it in copper foil, and then uh, solder it all together. So the glass doesn't come piece like that? No. Like it would, no, like it if comes, you went to Michael's? No, <laughs> <laughs> no certainly doesn't. Um, I order it anywhere from a 12 inch by 12 inch piece up and up to about a 24 by 24 awesome. inch piece I get from my manufacturer. So this could have been any array of glass? Any array. Gotcha. Any so, array. so did you just pick this out like just totally create, creatively? Is there a rhyme or reason for it, or is it just a feeling you get? Or you know, and you know, there's there's orange here, there's blue you got, here. You got your little you do whatever you rainbow, want, right? rainbow yeah. um, piece, chakra piece, um, however you want to hang it. Uh, this person actually wants to hang it um, horizontally like this. Okay, it could be hung, you know, cool vertically. So um, yeah, uh, it just I have a, two other pieces that are similar to this. One of them done in blues and purples. Another one done in orange, reds, and yellows. So just kind of however they, it's and a feel. The idea of the glass being enclosed is it's it's soldered, right? Yes. There's a whole soldering yes. to this. Do you consider this a two-way piece, meaning it can be uh, admired from both sides? Oh, absolutely. 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 Okay. Yes. That's yes. cool. Yeah. yeah. You know, because when we put pictures on the wall, you, you only see you get the a front one side. Yep. This, this is a 360 piece of art. Yes. Yes. Very, very cool. Yes, thank uh, you. So you took a class way back when, and way you never when. stopped. And I never stopped. I paused a little bit here, paused a little bit there. I, I went from my dining room table to my laundry room to having half of a one-car garage for studio space to the place that I have now. So in addition to, do, you do classes. Mm-hmm. Um, do you do retails per se? You just do I, make to order, right? I do, I do retail. I do have a few people coming in um, to shop and... Not a lot of walk-ins, a lot of customers that have sure. come either for classes or workshops that remember for communions, birthdays, weddings. Now, I was driving through Brooklyn the other day, and I saw Etsy. I believe that's where their headquarters are. Yes, Is I am on Etsy. A lot of people find good me experience? through Etsy. Yes. Wonderful. Yes. Okay. Yes. What makes a worldwide audience for you? Oh, absolutely. Absolutely. I mean, I've been overseas to many different countries, yeah. um, a lot of places here in the States that would have never known me just, you know coming into Port Jeff, walking around. Beautiful. And the thing about this is every piece you do is really custom. Yes. Really yes. Really cool. Yep. Wow. Tell me about this piece. Oh, I love that piece. This is so <laughs> unique. That piece is a lot of fun. Um, that piece is used, uh, uh, made using odds and ends, jewelry, broken jewelry, mm-hmm. old pieces, um, beads. It's mosaic glass on the back. And then um, we form a, a bouquet. Yeah. Yeah, stunning. Isn't it's it? it's Not great. I've Look had at that a, a little closer. It's a great memorial piece too. Mm-hmm. You know, if you have a family member that passed on and they have a lot of 
yes. jewelry yes. and you're not really sure what to do or you might not want to wear it, brooches, earrings. But it gets shown. Yes. Because jewelry yes. goes into the jewelry box and it's and never that's seen it. again. This yep. is awesome. Yep. Wow, yeah. beautiful. So the shop is on Halleck yep. Avenue. Anybody um, in Port Jeff Village that uh, has attended classes? You have people from all around the island? I have pe oh, yeah, people from all Good. around the island, sometimes Connecticut, uh, upstate New York, depending on, they'll, they'll come in for the weekend or something Good. and see that I have the workshops. Sure. And people find you on Instagram and Facebook, of course, Glass yep. Art Studios? Yes, sir. What does it look like uh, in the future for you, the business? Ooh. Uh. <laughs> right. So first of all, as an artist, right, you're always probably torn between the art of doing and doing your art and the reality of business and rent and all that. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So I also have a little bit of a, um, a conundrum. I don't, I don't know what the right wording is. Sure. I have a, a lot of pieces that get ordered that I make custom to do. And mm -hmm. it's just me. Yeah. I, don't, I don't have somebody working for me. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't always allot me time to make something that I want to start just to create from scratch to be able to hang and put up for sale. So it's it's kind of like a catch-22 almost. I'm very thankful for all the pieces that I've done. I'm actually doing a piece for the firehouse here in, oh, wow. yeah, in Port Jeff uh, yeah. for their kitchen, believe it or not. Um, and... Uh, it's that it's a balance a balancing act that I have to do right so the idea of uh, business in the future is just to become what a little bit more efficient I mean it's hard to efficient be efficient it, it is what it, it is. is it is I'm, I'm pretty particular about the pieces that I put out so right. having somebody come help me um, is a little tricky so you're saying this is a Bonnie bit our original they all are yes. I want to feel this man yeah yeah absolutely it's got some weight to it I love incorporating the wire into it too, so it just adds another dimension. It's so awesome. There's just something, I don't know, is it right for me to say it's peaceful? I feel peaceful. Yeah, yeah. yeah? So I guess a lot of people do. Yeah. Uh, this is really cool. Thank you. I'm gonna order one of these for the space because the space loves this. <laughs> well, thank you, Bonnie. Um, you um, I wanna tell that. everybody that again, um, actually I put it up on the screen. You have your uh, Instagram, which is how I found you, and uh, we're gonna like your Facebook page. Keep doing what you're doing. I'm so glad that it's your passion and you love it. Thank you, thank you. And my daughter's my Instagram person. Ah. So I do have a definite you do, helper. You are I, delegating a little in the I business. I am, absolutely. Actually, I think she delegated it herself, <laughs> but yes, absolutely. Fantastic. Well, thanks again for coming on. Thank you very much for having me. I really appreciate that. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you.